Hey what's going on guys my name is Ravi and welcome back to another Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial from Era Effects. So in this video we'll be learning to add a fast forward effect to our audio or a speed up effect to our audio without changing the pitch or without having any sort of squeaky sounds to it. To start off I already have an audio clip in my timeline and let me play this so that you can hear what it has. We'll be adding a speed effect or a fast forward effect to this audio clip. Alright, so now I'll right click on this and click on speed or duration. And to fast forward this, I'll set the speed value to 150 and click OK. If I start playing the video, this is how it sounds. We'll be adding a speed effect or a fast forward effect to this audio clip. You can see that it has some squeaky sound to it. So to fix that, I'll right click again and from speed and duration, I'll make sure to click on this maintain audio pitch. I'll check this and click OK. And now if I start playing the video, this is how it sounds. We'll be adding a speed effect or a fast forward effect to this audio clip. So it is much better than it was earlier, but it is not 100% perfect. To fix that, I'll uncheck this first. And from the FX panel, I'll type in pitch shifter. So you have this pitch shifter effect in the obsolete audio effects. I'm not using the obsolete one. I'm just using the pitch shifter effect. I'll drag this onto my audio. And now you have this pitch shifter effect added. And from custom setup, you have an option to edit. And now I'll decrease the semitones value to around negative 7 or negative 8 and now if I start playing the audio you can see that we won't be having any sort of you know the squeaky sound effect applied to it. We'll be adding a speed effect or a fast forward effect to this audio clip. So if I if I increase it further the audio becomes much we'll be bold. Adding a speed effect or a fast forward effect to this audio clip. But usually minus 8 or minus 7 works for a bold voice. Play around with these values so that you can fix the squeaky sound effect applied when you're fast forwarding the audio. We'll be adding a speed effect or a fast forward effect to this audio clip. Alright, I hope you found this video helpful and if that's the case, give us a thumbs up and if you'd like to talk with me regarding visual effects and video editing, you can always reach out to me on Instagram at VFX Kairavi. See you guys next time with another tutorial.